Welcome, it's Facts You Don't Know. If it's your first time here and you want to find out new facts that will definitely make you smarter and more. Well, and for make sure to subscribe and active the notification bell so you don't miss anything. Police officers must play their part in honor of their institution and uniform. They must fight evil and protect the weakest. But what if the victim and the one who transgresses the law are the same person? A police officer named Marcos Engraval was warned that there had been a robbery at a mall in Kansas. When he came to the place, he met a young mother of five children, all with a very bad appearance. The mother, Sarah, was crying, trying to explain why she did it. The woman told her that she was alone with her five daughters and that they were left homeless after her husband's tragic death in an accident four years ago. The officer looked at them carefully and realized that two little ones were sitting in the same car and didn't even have shoes. When Agent Engraval saw the stolen goods valued at $300, his soul hurt. The woman had taken out diapers, wipes, children's shoes, and other things needed only for children. The officer was a father, and at home he had two children waiting for him. He realized the woman did it out of desperation. Obviously, in the mall, they see her as a simple thief. But I also see a mother who is living in a very complicated situation, Engraval said. What he finally did was something that goes against the regular conduit. He filed an accusation of theft of items for a small amount, went to the store, and paid for everything the woman had stolen. The officer's colleagues learned about the woman and her touching story, so they organized a collection with donations for Sarah's family. The result was surprising. Along with local radio, they were able to gather about $6,000. Sarah and her family were very excited and grateful for this uniformed angel who became their hero. And the girls were finally able to get new shoes. But that's not all for today, as we have a similar story that will touch your heart. A story that regained hope of a humanity. A story that proves that we're still caring about each other and help each other also. An American police officer had a gesture of compassion in the pre-Christmas with a woman who'd robbed a store. The agent arrived at a supermarket on a theft complaint, but when he noted that the thief had only stolen food for their Christmas dinner of her two young daughters, she decided to dismiss the arrest and also paid part of the amount. The event occurred five days before Christmas at a stop-and-shop supermarket in the small town of Somerset, Massachusetts. That's where Officer Matt Lima arrived after a call for a report of a burglary at the site. Apparently, two women had stolen items by contraption by going through the scanner, some products, yes, and others had not, in the self-pay system. Upon discovery by the security of the site, the women, who were accompanied by two young girls, were held in the tent and Somerset police were immediately called. When Agent Lima arrived and saw that at the time of the woman's theft commission were two young girls present, he felt somewhat uncomfortable. I have two daughters, ages similar to those of the two girls, who were there, so I was a little shocked. The officer told local signal 10WJR, dependent on NBC. I spoke to one of the two women detained in the store, and she explained that she had a job, but the girl's mother was unemployed and had other family problems. She assured me that what this mom had taken was Christmas dinner for the girls, Lima added. The police then asked a store clerk to pass him the ticket with what the two women had bought and discovered that there was nothing but edible products. When he asked about the goods they'd stolen, which were not on the ticket, Obviously, they replied that it was all back in the gondolas of the supermarket. From what we'd seen on the receipt, all the women bought was food, the officer said, and that's when he decided to help them rather than punish them. Then, imbued by the Christmas spirit, the policeman dismissed the complaint and decided to help the jobless mother with some money so that she could purchase the Christmas dinner products correctly, attached to the law. Obviously, this family was in need, and I can't imagine having to make the decision to go to a stop and shop and pay only for what I can afford, or the desperation to go there and try to bring things for Christmas dinner, Lima explained. Therefore, the officer bought for the family a Christmas shopping card worth about $250 for the family to buy what was necessary for a Christmas dinner. I bought the card for a value approximate to what they'd taken. I just did what I felt was right. I just tried to put myself in the family's place and feel a little empathy, Lima said. The officer also said the girls were very grateful and a little surprised. I'm sure a lot of outcome in that same situation would think that there's going to be a different outcome, that maybe they could get arrested or they'd have to go to court, Lima concluded. 
George McNeil, head of Somerset Police, warmly congratulated Officer Lima on the action taken. According to information posted on the police department's official website, the policeman's actions exemplify what it means to protect and serve members of our community, McNeil said. When faced with a difficult situation where a family was trying to provide food for their children, they made the generous decision not to press charges and instead made sure they had a Christmas dinner they could enjoy, the police chief added. Now it's the end. We want to hear your opinion about those stories in the comments section below. If you like them, please share on social networks with your friend. Also, don't forget to hit the notifications bell so that you can be aware when we're sharing our next video. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks. We'll be right back to you as fast as we can.